Hey yo, what's good? You guys, welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And also, at any point in this video, if you guys are liking it, make sure to smash that thumbs up button as well. Anyways, today I am going to be doing a review on two sneakers. It is actually pretty much the same sneaker, just one's reflective and one isn't. And you guys already know by the title. It is the Yeezy Boost 350 V2 static in the reflective version and the non-reflective version so starting off with the box the first thing you guys notice is that they look 100 percent identical can you guys tell which one's reflective which one isn't i don't even know myself because they both say the colorway is static 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 all the way through both size eight i think this is the non-reflective one and this is the reflective one just by the size tag i bought this on stock x and the stock x one came with like this looking grid right here whatever you want to call that so the only difference in the box is going to be the style code which i think the reflective one is ef2 2367 and the non-reflective one is ef2909 and this one has the epc inside which has something to do about the tracking i still don't know nobody ever let me know in the comments down below which i wish somebody did because i need to be informed on that so i was right the top one is the reflective and i got some stock x just like i said paid about 500 dollars for it which you guys might think i'm dumb crazy for that but i'm not because <laughs> I believe the price will go back up in these. I could have paid a little less and got a little more profit down along in the future. However, I didn't weigh in at that 500 was a good price. But that's fine. I'll probably be able to sell these for like 100. I don't know how much more profit. 200, 300. Let's hope. That's what Easy Mafia says. I'm going to take the word for it because they are using Mafia and most of the time they're right. Sometimes I feel like they're BS, but hey, who knows? And right here is the non reflective version, which I don't know why it's looking so white on camera. All right, so I'm going to hold it this far because obviously if I put it too close, the light just. It's not even reflective. Why is it doing that, bro? Whatever. Non-reflective, reflective. Do you guys see the differences? If you guys see any differences right now, other than the tag right there, and hold up. These are both the left sneaker. Oh, I'm tripping. Wait, what? Hold on a second. So I just noticed that this one, this is the, damn, bro. Oh, shoot. Damn, I can't even sell these now. I don't know which one's which. Oh wait, no, this is the reflective right here. This is the non-reflective. So the reflective one comes with the hang tag or whatever you want to call this, I guess the size tag. This one doesn't on the left shoe, but on the right one, it's better because if not, stock X ride me. Oh, it did, all right, we're good. The other one did, as you guys can see right there, it's the right shoe on the reflective one for some reason, I don't know why. And of course it came with the stock X thing, whatever, authentication card. So the main difference is you guys can see, I don't know if you guys can tell right off the bat, but this one is wider, the reflective one. So to keep track, the reflective one is the one with the stock X hang tag. The one without it is obviously going to be the non-reflective one. So you guys can see the difference is gonna be that the reflective one is lighter, the non-reflective one is darker, it's gray. However, don't be fooled, this does have reflective on it and it is on the laces. I think that's about the only thing that's reflective on this sneaker. While this one has, it's not even that reflective. Like I took a picture of it with the flash on and it has a lot of reflection parts on it, but you don't notice it as much. I don't, I don't think the laces are reflective on this one. I'm not even sure, bro. Actually, yeah, they are, I'm lying, I'm lying. Another thing is that if you guys look at the build quality of the two, this one looks so much nicely built. Like the structure of it looks good. It looks like good quality. When you guys look at this one, it looks kind of fake. Like when I, I remember when I pulled out the box, I thought that it looked kind of fake. Just due to the shape, like this part right here kind of like flicks out like that. I don't know if you guys can see that. You guys can see it kind of flicks out. This one goes like straight up, which gives it like a better aesthetic look to it. I can't even put it too close to the camera. All right, so I'm about to like lower the ISO for this video. So you guys can see the quality. It looks nicer. It feels nicer. This one looks cheap. So it was about the same, maybe slightly cheaper, I don't know. But again, they did make these in way more quantity. Apparently there was only 5,000 of these, which doesn't make sense to me because right now on StockX, there has been around over a thousand sold. So let's say they sell the same amount on GOAT. There's about 2,000 sold, 2,500. There's no way there was 2,500 sold and there's only 5,000. Like the price of these would be way higher, but I'm assuming people don't know that exactly yet. Like Yeezy Mafia says there's 5,000. Everybody else says there's more like 15,000, 20,000. So that's why the price is going down. We'll just have to see in the future, like six months from now, according to what Yeezy Mafia said, they are supposed to go up. And that's the reason I bought these. It's more of an investment. I don't plan on wearing these. That's why they are dead stock. But yeah, other than that, guys, these sneakers don't really have that much of a difference. But something about the reflective one makes it look nicer. And it's not even the price point or the fact that it's reflective. Do you guys agree? Like, let me know down below because I might be tripping. It might just be my eyes, but I personally think the reflective one looks a lot nicer than this one. Everything else is identical. The heel tap colors are the same. The soles are the same. You can see they look like the same sneaker from the bottom. The pattern is literally the same, just the color is different. Since this one doesn't have the reflective material on it, 
they had to replace it with something so they made it like a great cloth or prime knit whatever you want to call it this one has a reflective material on it which is why it's lighter and when you take a picture with a flash it's supposed to reflect the whatever thing you're supposed to do i apologize guys the review sucks i've been like way out of the sneaker game not sneaker game but the youtube sneaker game for a while you guys can't, probably can't even see me back here there it is is the reflection of it's really not like you think it'd be like crazy reflective like the whole thing would be reflective that'd be dope honestly but it's only some parts are reflective now if you guys look at the non-reflective ones which is about to go on screen right now only thing reflective on them is the laces and the three stripes on the inside of the sneaker which i don't think were reflective on actually they are reflective as well on this reflective ones i've been saying reflective too much it's annoying me i gotta get done with this video i gotta wrap it up guys i got other things to do i gotta edit this video edit other videos for the vlog channel believe me guys i got so much going on if you guys see my bed right now it's still it looks the same for when I unpacked. It looks ridiculous. I need to still unpack all my stuff, clean up, get some schoolwork done. Yo, I'm telling you, when you got a lot on your plate, it gets stressful, but don't stress out, guys. Believe me, I'm gonna make a lot of videos. Just it might be a little content here and there, but it's going to be helpful to you guys or entertaining, hopefully, to you guys. Whether it be on this channel or the other channel, it doesn't matter. Make sure you guys subscribe to both so you guys don't miss out on any content that I post. Anyways, guys, until next time, make sure you guys keep grinding. It's your boy Sneaker signing out. Peace.